It is Monday morning, day after Valentine. This is my church coffee mug. <laughs> oh, I made me a latte. My husband ended up getting me a latte machine. I'm not sure if you can see it over there. I'm about to enjoy this upstairs in the library with a good book. Um, guys, I want to show you all something that's so beautiful and magical to me. I set this here. It's really dreary outside, too. Let me show you guys how dreary it is outside. I'm going to show you a few changes that I have made in here. See how dreary it is out there, guys? It is really dreary. But I have a beautiful piece that was imported from Italy that my husband gifted me for Christmas and there she is isn't she a beautiful piece of art guys when I tell you she's extremely large she's really really heavy <laughs> and she's beautiful I'm sorry I put my hands there guys she's beautiful absolutely gorgeous so I've added some art around the house i had this big picture um there but i decided to put it right here my husband gifted me for valentine's day with this beautiful piece of art it is gorgeous and that is the artist i am a true jazz and art lover so i wanted my home to reflect that I just love it. And he also gifted me some French, um, I guess you could guess call it stoneware. Let me, <laughs> it's beautiful. Let me see if I can flip my bowl over here. Well, you know, that bowl is so big. I don't want to flip that one if you guys can see. It is absolutely beautiful, guys. I just love it. He went all the way out. These are mine. I just love it. He went all the way out for these little trinkets that I love. And when I tell you they pop in this dining room so well, they are just absolutely beautiful in there. And after living here for over 13 years, we decided to put um, a rug up down here. We didn't have a rug in here for over 13 years. And I had my husband move this table. Guys, never again. And of course, I put a one that fills up my living room in there. Um, I... That covers the whole, not fill it up. <laughs> but I've never really had a rug um, in that space as well. And the the painting I had there was um, this painting here. I hope you guys can see. And I'm getting window treatments um, for my all of my windows. It's taken me forever but I'm finally deciding to do it. <laughs> My husband doesn't want cur curtains. I call them window treatments, curtains, whatever. He doesn't want them. I do, so I end up winning. So we're going to have someone come and do all the measurements. I'm just going to put them downstairs. I'm not going to put them upstairs yet. So it'll be um, in here. Uh, pretty much my dining room and my living room. But this was the painting that was in the foyer and it is so beautiful in here i just love it it's it just looks so good there and it's gonna look even better when i finally get some window treatments <laughs> oh. and this is time to move on up to the library
How's your day going so far, guys? Mine's going very well, very relaxing. And as you can see, you guys have seen this loft area multiple times. So, sitting room slash loft area. This is my new gaming system. And I'll show you guys that on a later video. It is absolutely amazing. But right now, I'm about to sit in my library. I think I'm going to turn on the uh, fireplace and read i am reading a wonderful book guys and let me show it to you um sit my coffee here i am enjoying this book his only wife and it is so good you know um if you get a chance Please check this out. It's like a, a young seamstress in Ghana was chosen to marry into this wealthy family. The only problem is her husband is in love with another woman, <laughs> the husband for whom she was chosen to marry. And he basically did not come to the wedding. He, They had a wedding without him. I don't know how that was possible, but it happened. And it's just getting into her being adjusting to this new normal. It is, when I tell you guys, it's really good. So when you get a chance, check this out. And I'm about to turn on the fireplace, cuddle up in my blanket, drink my coffee, and at least get, I try to get me at least 30 minutes to an hour in of reading. Alrighty, guys, so I'm having me a lunch. Actually, it's like one something. I gotta hang my clock up because I was gonna replace that clock with this clock here. But I get this all the way home because I found that at a state sale and it doesn't work. And um, just can't find anyone to fix it. I would prefer to have that up there. So we'll see how it goes. But I'm about to have a lunch. Um, just one, only one quick glass of this nice white. Then I'm going to recork it and put it back in the fridge for sometime later this week. But since I'm off today, it's an off day and I'm having this delicious lunch. This is leftover lasagna. It looked much better than this, guys. I had to chop it all up to get it to warm throughout, but yeah. Alrighty, guys. I'll see you tomorrow, I guess. Because I don't have anything going tonight. <laughs> hey, guys. I decided to be on camera today. <laughs> today is Tuesday, guys. And I am actually heading to um, this event. I tried to go on Saturday. It didn't work out. So, you pay $10 and you get a full cart of groceries. So, I'm going to actually see how it pans out. It is extremely cold out here. So last time I went Saturday, it was a line of people. It's a little too cold to wait out today. So I'm hoping, oh gosh, you guys are bouncing. So I'm hoping that I don't have to do that today, guys. So I'll let you know how this turns out. On my way there now, I was supposed to be there at 9 o'clock, but because we had black ice this morning, uh, we did have an advisory to kind of not go out in the morning. So, we shall see. I went, and this is my buggy. 
They gave me all of this for ten dollars. It's extremely cold, <laughs> so I'm not gonna be able to really do much. But I want to show you guys this. And guys, I'm gonna get this stuff in the in the car because it's extremely cold. <laughs> Alright guys, I have managed to bring everything in the house. I want to get this stuff put up really quickly. Well, let me show you what some of the things I did get. Um, I got a 24 case of this sunny water. That's what they had gave me. Um, I have um, spaghetti strings. I have olive oil, which I was super excited about. But of course, you know guys, I'm going to go through and check the dates on everything. But um, I think this is okay. No. Yep. Um, all of this bread that I gotta go through and I gotta check the dates on the bread. Um, a big thing of um ice cream cones. I have tons of meat in here, which actually I'm getting ready to cook this now because this is about to be my lunch. Um uh, <laughs> that is um mozzarella stuffed beef and pork meatballs. And so about to eat that i got rotisserie chicken i have a bunch i have a bunch of cheese i have hot dogs uh lots of snacks random vegetables in here yogurt beef broth i found this guy's yellow thai coconut curry that i want to cook something with um honey -os, cape cod chips, um, bread sticks, Z bars, um, a large thing of eggs here, corn flakes, um, another bar here, and this is all natural turkey with queso and jalapeno. I'm going to keep, I'm going to refreeze that because those are turkey burgers I'm going to eat. And of course, these, this is my stuff I'm making gumbo tonight. Um, I have um kind i have um peanut butter and dark chocolate peanut butter i have mary's gone crackers i have trail a trail mix bar which is gonna go great well the crackers tonight like i said i'm eating um gumbo tonight i have something called peep cereal i don't know if my son's gonna eat that or not coconut water a gallon of milk and i got four gallons of this tea i got so much other crackers and stuff y'all so i got all of that for ten dollars it's not bad especially with this beef broth and all of that these are things that i really need i use a lot i'm going to make some curry um thai curry chicken this week i got our uh, uh, rosemary and garlic uh, potato garlic and rosemary potato pancake mix this is something i've never tried before but <laughs> i'm gonna try that so all right, guys, so I got to get all of this stuff put up, dates checked, stored away, some of this stuff frozen, and then I got to do a little cleaning, get me some lunch cooked, and then get my gumbo going. So, and I'll end this vlog by showing you my gumbo later on tonight. Hey, guys, before I ended the vlog completely for today with the gumbo, I wanted to show you the lunch. I got these um, beef and pork mozzarella stuffed meatballs uh, from the place where I just came. So I decided to cook those. Um, I did some roasted red pepper. I love this, you guys. Oh my God. Emerald's roasted red pepper sauce. And I have some, of course, some noodles over here. And that's gonna be my lunch. And because I have so much bread, I'm gonna go ahead and toast me up a piece of bread. And that's my lunch. Alrighty, guys. My there's a little bit more to my class here, and I'm having a wonderful um, finishing up a red wine, actually Polaris red wine, California wine. It is delicious, and my gumbo is done. And it is, guys. It smells amazing I have my white rice over there and I am about to bowl me up some my bowls are I'm using some little plastic crazy looking bowls so I really don't want to show those <laughs> 
I don't, guys. I don't want to show those because they are so crazy looking. But um, if my bowls didn't look so bad, I would um show it to you guys. I really would. So I'm gonna end the vlog here, guys. And I mean, um. That red wine is really good. I cannot wait to bowl me up some of my gumbo, some of these delicious crackers that I got today to eat with it. So I'm just really, really excited. I really, really am. So guys, I am back. I'm going to try to do videos every Wednesday. Um, I have a video coming on cancer. I want to talk to you guys about that and um, how it's affecting my life. So I have that coming that will be next wednesday so yeah i think i'm just gonna do day in the life videos because it just shows you know me you know my day in my life so nothing wrong with that right <laughs> Alrighty, guys well i'm about to bowl up my um gumbo like i said i'm kind of embarrassed by my bowls i'm not gonna show y'all my bowls but <laughs> queen sugar comes on the night so i'm excited and that's going to be my night, guys. So I am screaming good night, be blessed, and I'll catch you on the next video.